Hey, this is Ponce yet again on the Public Test Realm, uh, here to talk to you this time about Seeker's Arm Guard, a brand new item that presumably will be introduced into the live server um, relatively soon. Um, don't know when the patch is actually coming out, but yeah, this is available for testing now. Um, and I thought this is quite an interesting item because... Well, I figure the... Well, why don't we just go over what the item is first. Um, basically, it, um, it's, it builds out of cloth armor, cloth armor, and amplifying tome, and has a total cost of 1,160. And what this gives you is 30 armor, 25 ability power, and a unique passive. Killing unit grants 0.5 bonus armor and ability power. This bonus stacks up to 30 times. Um, and these are permanent, by the way. Once you get the stacks, they're full. So we're, we're getting another stack-up item after they just got rid of War Mogs. Um, but it's an early game stack item. So And then it eventually builds into Zonya's Hourglass, so it does turn into something useful. And uh, it looks like the Zonya's Hour... I covered the Zonya's Hourglass change um, in the, my other video, but the cost has gone up a bit. And it looks like it just absorbs the stacks, whether or not they're up they exist or not, and then it turns into 50 armor total in the end. Um, but yeah, it's an interesting item because I figure what Riot is trying to accomplish here, and I could be wrong, but I'm going to guess that it has something to do with the fact that um, AD caster assassiny type people are becoming very prevalent in mid lane, and um, yeah, AP casters, when you send them mid, don't really have a good answer for them in terms of being, like, providing some kind of defense and yet maintaining an offensive output. I mean, I guess you could rush chain vest, but that's just really weird and yeah, not not ideal. Um, it also does provide some interesting options for sort of tanky AP-ish champions, I guess. Like, you could build this really early on on Rumble. I mean, it probably wouldn't be too bad. Although it, it would hurt to slow down your uh, flat penetration on a champion like that. Might be good on Xerath. Um, but yeah, mainly I just think it's it's to give uh, AP mids a chance to fight back against uh, AD casters and assassin -y, jumpy AD casters especially. Like, uh, for example, Talon's become a popular mid. Um, Kha'Zix is a popular mid. You know, stuff like that. I'm sure you've seen it in-game. Especially if you play mid lane. I don't, so really I don't care what happens mid lane <laughs> because I'm a top laner. But, um, yeah, I'll, basically I'll just um, no, go show you what it looks like when this thing is stacking up. So let's just teleport into lane. Right now I've killed a couple things and it's stacked up to eight. By the way, it does go up from jungle mobs. So... Just kill things real quick. Kill two, it should go up in a sec. There's a bit of a delay on it actually showing up. on the mobs are going to kill me because I'm such a low level. So it should all go up in a second here. Yeah, we're up to 10. Up to 12. Yeah, so there we go. So that wave there gave me basically 4 AP and um, 4 armor. To the point. Like it says, it shows you how much you've collected. Um, yeah, so that's it for now. I don't really have too much else to say about this. I, I don't know how efficient it'll be building into it early and all that kind of thing. I mean, that, that requires testing. I'm sure it's viable. And I mean, if you're getting the crap kicked out of you by an AD caster mid, I mean, yeah, you gotta do something. And I guess this gives you options. So yeah, this has been Ponce from uh, lifeintheleague.com slash livestream. Livestream every weekday 8 p.m. to 8, uh, or 1 p.m. to 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And you can follow me at, uh, at Ponce underscore lol at Twitter and uh, twitch.tv slash Ponce for updates, exact updates when I start streaming. So hopefully you found that uh, interesting. This is kind of a neat item you're able to look forward to if they release it eventually. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching and goodbye. Oops, wrong thing. There we go.